Hey guys, welcome to another tutorial on my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create this special effect in Filmora 12. Okay, so that is very simple. Yes, it is super simple. You can create a loop or anything like that in Filmora 12 in just some seconds. Okay, so this is my example project in Filmora 12 and you can see that I have some version here. So this is the first version where I shoot myself in front of the camera and also take the snapshot of my video and then I create the print screen effect and also an intro here and another version where I just use the stock media and then I create the effect and give you some instruction on how to sh shoot the film okay and uh, let's delete everything okay so the easiest way to have you understand this effect is to use the stock media okay so for example we can go to stock media and then we can use any stock media for example I already download something okay so go to my and download Okay, so this is my downloaded folder and I'm going to use this woman uh, inside, inside the office. Just run, drop it onto the timeline and then select keep the project setting. Okay, and then I can play the video. Okay, so I'm going to stop here. At the, this position, I want to free this frame so that I can create the green screen effect. So all I need to do is to take a snapshot here. But by the way, I'm going to go back to my media and then i can take a snapshot of this woman and then i can split the video right here and delete the rest okay and the next thing i want to start shooting my second video with this snapshot on my mobile phone okay so in order to do that all i need to do is to right click here and select review in explorer to find this snapshot on my computer okay so this is a snapshot and the next thing I want to send this to my phone via email okay so I'm going to open my email address here and then select compose and then I can send it to myself okay and subject could be sent to phone number three and then I'm going to write and drop the image to here so at the snapshot folder and then I can write and drop it here and then I can click send. By the way, you have different way to send an image to your phone, right? And just click send. And now I'm going to take my, my phone. Okay, open my phone, email on my phone, and then view the image. Okay, so I'm going to rotate my phone. So this is the image on my phone. Okay, so it is in full screen. By the way, when you film your second shot, remember to put it closer to the lens like this so that it covers the lens. Otherwise, you have to adjust the animation so that it can string to your full screen. Okay, but it's up to you. And then you want to go back to Filmora. For example, I have another video here of me this is a video of me uh, with this one so the, the next thing you want to drag and drop your video your second video onto the timeline and then you want to play the video like something like this okay so at this position I put the phone in front of the lens so I can cut the video right here and then I can delete this one and then I want to move the video to this position. Okay, so let's zoom in the timeline so that uh, you can see it better. And the next thing, you want to put the snapshot at this position. Okay, so this is my snapshot. Just simply drag and drop it right here. Okay, and now we don't see the videos, right? The video under the snapshot, so it is a little bit difficult. By the way, we want to select the snapshot and then we can add the first keyframe. Okay, so this is my first keyframe and we want to create another keyframe. Add about two frames for what? Okay, so at this position, we want to create another keyframe. Okay, so you want to double click at the snapshot and then you want to go to basic and you want to adjust the opacity of the snapshot 
okay so I'm going to reduce the opacity to zero okay so by doing that we can replace the first one the first snapshot with the video okay so let's click OK and that is finished for my green screen effect and so that's easy right and let's play the result okay uh, I'm going to mute the audio here so it is very simple just use the animation keyframe to reduce the opacity to zero so this is the final result Okay, so this is the first solution when you shoot the second shot with your mobile phone cover the lens. By the way, if you just put your phone right here, there's another solution. Okay, so I'm going to delete this one. Okay, so let's use this video. Okay, so this is the intro and this is the, uh, the second shot. Okay, and let's put it on the timeline. Okay, so I'm going to use take number two of this video. So I'm going to delete the first one. Hey guys, and play. welcome to another tutorial on my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create this special effect in Filmora 12. Okay, so at this position, I want to take a snapshot or create a free frame. So my suggestion is to take a snapshot and then we have a snapshot here and then we can cut this one and delete this one. And now you need to send this snapshot to your phone and you can do the same. And I already have it on my phone and now we can use the second one and this is the second video okay so you start from here okay so that and is very just pull back to your body let's go to my okay so we can use this one okay so we can just put this video under here and then we want to put the snapshot at this position also okay and now we need to keyframe this snapshot okay so we want to put the playhead at the beginning and then we want to add the first animation keyframe okay and then we want to move maybe two frame or three frame forward uh, okay so this is three frame and then we want to add another animation keyframe but that is keyframe firstly we want to reduce the opacity to maybe 50 percent and now we want to click here on the screen and then we want to scale it down because the size is different okay try to scale it down and to the side of the phone screen okay so it is still too big it is still too big and we can just put it here I think it's just okay now we need to reduce the opacity to zero at this keyframe okay and then we can play okay so I think it is too slow uh, for the keyframe so we are going to move it to two frame and then we can play okay I think it's okay so this is the second solution to create this green screen effect, uh, if you just put your phone right here, and then you have to keyframe the image to this side, okay, to this side to match with the size of the phone. By the way, it is an easy way to create green screen effect in Filmora 12. I hope this video is helpful for you. If you have any more questions, just let me know at the comment section below. By the way, if you want to download or purchase Filmora 12, Check out my video description. I put my 20% discount coupon code at the description. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Goodbye.